I saw a very funny and descriptive image on Facebook the other day and it says this is how I pick my uh, car tire and it was a guy throwing a dart uh, blindfolded um, on the on the board and then this is how I pick my commuter tire or my bicycle tire and there is like this whole chart and the guy is calculating on computers and monitors and analyzing every single aspect so <laughs> in this video I want to present to you uh, a few reasons why I think uh, a 32 millimeter tire is the ideal tire width for a commuter bike and the first reason is that a 32 millimeter tire is still quite narrow so you can go reasonably fast of course the narrower your tire the less rolling resistance it has so a really narrow say 23 25 millimeter tire is super narrow and it can go really really fast and I think the 32 millimeter tire is still in that range and once you go above 32 if you go to 35 37 millimeters you feel the extra bulk so that is the first reason the second reason is that a 32 millimeter tire is not too narrow to make your ride very harsh so as you go up in uh, as you make your tire wider and wider so as you go up in tire width your ride becomes softer and softer a 32 millimeter tire is the first one where you can feel that it provides just some extra cushioning and it absorbs some of the, ro of the road buzz the third reason is that at 32 millimeters you don't need to rock your bicycle tires at a very high pressure in order to eliminate the chances of pinch flats so you can go up to a reasonably high pressure but you can still make it soft enough so you can go through cobblestones and potholes confidently without having to worry that uh, you're going to get a pinch flat the next reason is that there is so many commuter tires in the 32 millimeter range uh, that you can choose from uh, I mean you can go from really inexpensive but still very good commuter tires to really expensive and really puncture resistant tires so you have so many choices I made a comparison video I'm going to put that in uh, the description I'm going to put a link in the description if you want to compare some of the best 32 millimeter tires that's the go-to video I also love 32 millimeters because it performs so well on a variety of surfaces you can go on gravel you can go on paved roads you can go off-road so it really performs it just strikes a really good balance of uh, performance traction and it's a great tire width to take on a great variety of surfaces the last reason is actually me and you um, what I mean is I am not great at maintaining my bike I talk about it all the time but I am not the best example to follow when it comes to maintaining your bike but a 32 millimeter tire is pretty forgiving in case you forget to inflate it to the proper pressure if you go uh, narrower than that 28 millimeters 25 millimeters that is going to be very unforgiving you're going to end up with a puncture very soon if you don't maintain the proper pressure 32 millimeters well if you forget to check your tire pressure every week every two weeks it's not going to be a big deal maybe you can go for even for a month without topping up your tire pressure so there you are those are my top reasons why I think 32 millimeter tires are the best for commuting but I want to know your experience and what your experience is let me know in the comments below and i hope to see you in the next one take care bye bye <laughs>